Hey there guys, and welcome to a new Let's Play on my channel. It's a game I've been wanting to play for a very long time. Tales of Zestaria. Now, if you're probably wondering, Robin, why do you have to continue on? Like I said before, borrow my friend's uh, Steam. So, I have pretty much all this stuff. So, let's see. I confirm being put that. Just making sure everything's in order. Open a world map, that'll be this button, I guess. Raise action, reset camera. Uh, show objective. Fuck. Ah, god damn. That should do it, I think. Just make sure everything's in order so I can actually do stuff. everything so guys let's go gonna go on gonna go on no, uh, moderate I'm not gonna do hard just yet um, let's go the legend of the shepherds in a bygone age of myths, when darkness threatened to enshroud the world, it was they who reclaimed light from nothingness. Over and over, as the world plunged into chaos, the legend would come to people's lips, and they would pray for salvation. And lo, each time a shepherd would appear to vanquish the darkness once more. But with peace returned, it was never long before the shepherds would vanish. As for where they had gone, no one can truly say. And, as with all things, eventually they faded into legend. again, the world faced the threat of the darkness. people began to speak of the shepherds once more. But alas, no shepherd came forth to guide his people to peace. I guess I get to do control them now. Sweet. So, um, I'm not too familiar with this game. I'm familiar with the Tales series, but not this one. Um, let's see. Let's start. Okay, so. Okay. Oh. There's my mouse in the way. Like I said before, this is a Steam version, so there's going to be a few snippets. Friend for more than one second, potentially. Um, see what he's got. Hat style, young man. Discovery book, skill book, enemy book, system book. Plus still record and Apple Tales. So not much, then. I...
I knew it. A hero brandishing the sacred blade. This mural is a depiction of the shepherd. <laughs> About time I found it. Nothing on my end, Soray. Miklio. Looks like he beat me this time. <laughs> this proves the Shepherds have been around since even before the era of Asgard. I knew it! Let's not jump to conclusions just yet. We still don't have definitive proof that this ruin itself is pre-Asgard. It could be an imitation. Seriously? You really think they'd make a fake ruin of this scale? Get real. This doesn't bode well. Wait, isn't that... I think our ruin adventure is over for today. I get a little help, please? Didn't go quite how I planned it, but not too shabby, am I right? Guess this makes us even. Unbelievable. Who knew there'd be ruins underground? Oh, good thing we fell down here. Right. Hey, let's try and find a way out of here. Hmm? Oh, yeah. Alright, so I guess just run around I guess. I just talk to McLean. Better leave the investigation for another time. We need to find a way out of here. Alright. Alright, save. Save point. What the f Oh my god, really? Like, I don't know why it likes my mouse so much. Like, look at this. We'll be doing this. Which actually works now. Let's go. Whoa! Oh man, what a drop. It's been nothing but heights all day. But I had an awesome bar relief to distract me. Yeah, I bet you did. Hmm? It looks like someone's lying there. Hey, Miklio? Hmm? It's... it's a human. It can't be. Stop. We shouldn't involve ourselves with their kind. She's still alive. We can't just leave her there. Fine. I'll give what help I can. Let's take a look around the area first. Okay. Human? So, are they like not human or something? Well, I know... Okay, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you guys. I do know quite a bit about this game. Uh, Ugh, my sword's all sticky! Cobwebs everywhere. I bet no one has set foot in here for some time. Huh? 
What's wrong? Shh. There! It's huge! What is this thing? Quit gawking and get your sword ready. Do I have any art? I have none. Why does it think I'm using them? True Fang, Striking Fang. I don't know why the game thinks I'm using a keyboard. But whatever. It's something I'm gonna have to deal with before I get a PlayStation controller. Hold on, it can't be a Hellion? A Hellion? For real? I've never seen one in person before. What could a monster like a Hellion be doing in a place like this? It's getting away! Wait, don't you remember what Gramps told us? Huh? Hellions? Yep. Aliens. Horrible monsters that are created by the malevolence. They can only be defeated by the power of purification, which not but a chosen few can use. So if you ever cross paths with a Hellion, just run as fast as you can. Remember, you two. Common folks like us don't stand a chance against those fiends. Cut it? Yet that was years ago. We what can't beat a Hellion without the power of purification. Then we should just be glad we escaped it. And anyway, we have bigger problems. Hmm? We have to hurry and save that girl before something worse finds her. So we're trying to get that neat. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I'm gonna keep saying keyboard stuff, but I'm using the controller to play the game. Whatever. Let's see, ancient earrings. Uh, each piece of equipment has four slots. First one to set up each person's item. Skill sheet. Basic skills attached to your opponent's uh, your equipment skill slots and bonus skills activated by certain arrangement skills. Bonus skills. Okay. Created by stacking multiple copies of the, of the same basic skill. The number indicates how many skills are uh, how many how many of that skill is equipped? Equip two or more and activate the bonus skill. Elemental Union created by equipping skill equipping skills uh, directly adjacent to each other um, on left or right. Line up two or more to activate a bonus skill. Created by okay, this is gonna go on for a very long time. Why is it in player two? What is going on? Isn't that a way to turn that off? Whatever, I'll fix it later. Is that a monolith? There's your monolith. Uh, oh. Martial art. I 
figure out how to switch. Just managed to fend them off. Oh, great. I can't actually fight them. But yeah, if there's any tutorial stuff, I'll just read it and I'll read it off camera because it's gonna take either read it off camera or edit it out because this that's gonna take a minute. Case of Thunder. That human probably got caught up in all the lightning just like we did. More like the other way around. We have her to thank for all that crash boom bang. That lightning. That was Gramps, wasn't it? Yeah. It's a warning to invaders. Not one more step. <sighs> Sorry, Gramps. I can't just leave someone who needs help. Huh. This is turning into an eventful day for once. That was a cool monolith. We've had quite a bounty of discoveries today. If I'm not mistaken, that stone is a lot newer than the surrounding ruins. Yeah, it's from a completely different age. It read like advice of some sort. Most likely it's a guidepost left by previous visitors to aid fellow travelers. So we're not the only ones who go around investigating ruins. Humans have terms for them. Things like adventurer or explorer. Explorers. Crap. I forget how... Yes, sir. Crap, get out of my way. Whatever, I'll figure it out later. I don't remember what I said that for. <sighs> I want the power to stand against the Hellions. Might have to end it. Actually, stop right here for a second so I can fix the quick control. Alright, I'll see you guys in a minute, so... I can control my damn mouse. And, hey there guys, and we're back. Sorry about that, I had to fix the controls again, because for some reason, I had problems with the mouse, and apparently, there's no way to fix that where the mouse doesn't take up about half of your screen for some reason. So, I'm stuck with it. Er, wait. Wait, can I actually get experience from that thing? Weapons ready! Okay, he's just gonna just keep saying that, so whatever. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should stop being cheap and just buy a real controller, dang it. Let's do this! Ready? Like I said before, I'm using a controller, but the game keeps thinking I'm using a... The game keeps thinking I'm using a keyboard and mouse, but I'm using a controller 
but that's because Steam doesn't recognize my uh, Steam doesn't recognize my uh, my controller that well. Alright. Uh, let me just see how. Hmm? What's this? Whoa! What the? I'll be taking this. If you get too hung up on fiddling with it, we'll never get out of here. I'll give it back once we return safely. Uh, <laughs> if you say so. So close, but it's still so far. Think we could jump? Only one way to find out. Okay, let's see. Spirit chain lower your spirit spirit uh, SC the higher the amateur quest. It's generally not recommended as S D. Okay. Well, Okay, maybe not. Hey, watch out! Don't scare me like that. Sorry about that. Well, we definitely can't make it from here. There should be a connected point somewhere. Let's go back and see what we can find. Also, to be fair, I did watch a bit of the anime. So I know a little bit of the game and I guess a little bit of the game and a little bit of the anime. I haven't really watched much of it. I tried to avoid it until it was finished because I couldn't really stand that. Oh. I see. So that's the deal. Huh? Haven't figured it out. Y yeah, I have. There's a uh, staircase coming up from below. You're totally lost, aren't you? Hmm? I could have sworn. I mean, isn't there? Not even close. Look. An invisible bridge. That's better. Mm-hmm. Seems safe enough. Yeah. Oh, the power of bullshit. Okay, found the discovery point, the invisible bridge. This bridge is incredible. How do you think it was made? I think this is beyond the capabilities of human technology. So, like, the bridge alone might date from the era of the gods? Possibly. But either way, they definitely had assistance, whether from Seraphim like me or someone else. They really didn't want anyone to reach the other side. The path Ayo. ahead leads to Elysia. It stands to reason that they do what they can to protect the Pure Land. In the past, any pilgrims who showed up at the shrine probably thought the gap was simply uncrossable. Same as we did until just minutes ago. Get in that booty! Maybe we should rethink this. Hey! Uh, are you alright? Uh, <sighs> I was... I was in a forest and then... Looking for this? I got the same eye color. Yep, she's human, all right. Yeah. Glad you're okay. I'm sorry to have troubled you. And you are? 
Your name. Uh, oh. Right. My name. I'm Saray. Saray? Yep. Nice to meet you. Well met. Is there anywhere one could rest around here? I'll need to make plans to get back to the capital. You're from the city? Well... Um... Hmm. Why don't you come to where I live? Saray, are you nuts? Are you sure that wouldn't be a problem? You barely know me. I can't just abandon someone in need. That's all. Haven't you noticed that she won't even volunteer her name? It's only natural to be cautious. Aren't you going to ask my name? Are you sure? Everyone has their reasons, but you don't look like a bad person to me. I cannot possibly thank you enough, Saray. <sighs> Gramps is gonna let us have it when we get back. I know. Yes? Nah, don't worry about it. Anyway, that's the way out. Let's get moving. Alright, uh, My experience, we have really bad experience. <sighs> Stupid mouse, you know what, screw it. The game, for some reason, keeps thinking I'm using a mouse. But now I'm gonna have to remind you, but keep your eyes on the girl. Okay. But too bad we didn't meet in better circumstances. <sighs> you really don't have a skeptical bone in your body. Skeptic? Oh. So we're trying to get some. <sighs> we made it back in one piece. Wow, it's beautiful. Like a shrine out of myth. I half expect to see Seraphim wandering around. You really do call them Seraphim. Is that funny to you? Nope. Things which cannot be seen or explained, such as gods, spirits, or supernatural phenomena, are revered by the people as Seraphim. Right? A quote from the Celestial Record? Bingo. You've read it too? Yep. Wait, you as well? I used to read it all the time when I was a kid. It's a little ways from here to my village. Let's get moving. Okay. <laughs> McLeo is ticked. So, uh, is the Celestial Record a children's book? Hmm? Well, I mean, you said you read it when you were a kid. Plenty of adults read it, too. I was probably just mature for my age. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah? Huh. Well, figures. I mean, it is an amazing book. Yes. Well, it looks like someone's enjoying himself. This is my village. Alicia. So it's not Camlon, but Alicia, then. I'll go report this to Gramps. Guess we can't keep quiet about all this. Coming by afterwards? Yeah. We're dead. Hey everyone! Got someone to introduce to you! Uh... <laughs> This is my family, living here at the Shrine. Is this, uh, some kind of performance piece? No, uh, it's nothing. Don't worry about it. You're an odd duck, you know that? I guess. That's my house. You go ahead and rest. I've got something to take care of. May I have a look around the village? Well, sure, but don't cause trouble. 
Of course not. I'll behave as if I were in a shrine to the Seraphim. Yeah, exactly. I'll try not to make any waves. <laughs> oh man, I sure hope Miklio's chat with Gramps went over well. We're screwed. Sorry, I know, I know I keep saying it, but you gotta be more careful with those Hellions. You might be able to drive them off, but you won't be able, you can't do away with them for good. It's a pity that we Seraphim don't have the power to purify them. So, I guess these guys don't have it. Uh, great. Let me go... I need to put on the ancient earrings I have from the ruins. And I'll let you hear the rest from Soray himself. I reckon I'll have to. Idiots! Hi, Gramps. I'm back. How could you bring a human into our domain? Easy, Gramps. Didn't you say you'd listen to Soray's side of the story, too? That's just what I'm about to do. You know full well the rules, Soray. How could you break them like this? I'm sorry, Gramps, but I couldn't just leave her there. Her kind is sure to bring nothing but trouble to our domain. But I'm her kind too, you know. You were raised along with our kind, which nurtured in you the ability to perceive us and converse with us. Normal humans have no such capacity. You should understand that more than anyone else. Well, it is true. She doesn't appear to have any resonance. But Gramps, this is the first time Soray's ever met a fellow human. Perhaps. But if she can't see or hear the same things we do, she has no business in this realm. Uh... I have raised both of you as my own since you were but babes, all the while doing my best to protect this land. And for that, I am grateful. And I did that because the time draws near when you will both serve to protect this shrine, just as all the others have done. Our priority is the peace of Elysium. Any intruders, no matter how harmless, must be cast out. Yes. Then it's time she left. Can we at least give her time to prepare for her departure? Hmm. Just make it quick. Thank you. Gramps. I know, I know, McLeo. He means well, in all things. And that's the very reason why I'm so worried for him. <laughs> ugh, ugh. Sorry about that. Something got stuck in my tooth. Stuck in my tooth. But yeah, we need to go and see that girl. No matter how much her voice kind of gets on my nerves, but I'm not gonna be biased here and say that she sounds kind of kind of annoying. Hey. 
Hey, wow! Is this crest what I think it is? Yep, this is the mark of the shepherd. I knew it! The chosen one who communicates with the seraphim, controlling their incredible powers as if they were his own. The shepherd! <laughs> Sound like your kind of thing? Maybe. I always thought that Mankind's Savior would actually look a bit more imposing. Be silent, Seraph Beast! I shall not. <laughs> Excavated relics aren't play toys. True. She certainly is taking her time. I'll see what's up. Oh, we're not wearing it. Boo. Oh, didn't even see her right in front of me. Hmm. Enjoy yourself? I sure did, but it's weird. I felt like I was being watched the whole time. Uh, uh. Shall we eat? I'm sorry. I feel like I'm going to faint. Let's head to my place. Gosh. I hope we didn't worry him. Hmm? Oh, uh, nothing. Welcome in. Better take your shoes off before you come in my house. That's actually kind of a big thing with me. You better take your shoes off before you come in my room. Hey! Hmm? So then, what's your hometown like? Well, I'm from the capital, Lady Lake, in the Kingdom of Highland. Lady Lake? Like in the Legend of the Sacred Blade? You've heard of it? It was in the Celestial Record! The legend says the Lady of the Lake guards the Sacred Blade, and the one who draws it becomes the Shepherd, right? Yes. It was a lively and bustling town, blessed with bountiful water, rich in festivals and fine drink. Wait, was? Well, it used to be. Things must be hard for folks in the world below. Below? The land that lies beneath the mountaintops. I've never left home before. You've always lived here by yourself? Sounds to me like you're the one who's had it rough. <laughs> Oh, let me help you get ready for your return trip tomorrow. You need anything? Bread, rations, stuff like that? That'd be great. If you have any tools or a sleeping bag, it'd be great too. Gotcha. Well then, first we'll need to do some hunting. I'll be your guide tomorrow. Thank you so much for everything. I hope she, don't, I hope she realizes this ain't free. Good morning. Good morning. Come on! Hurry it up, Mikleo. We ain't got time to mess around. Yeah, I'll leave in a moment. <sighs> Gramps gave me all kinds of things to take care of. I'm gonna be pretty swamped for a while. Bummer. Well, don't you worry about me, at least. So, Ray, Gramps only wants... Yeah, I know. Maybe later. Sure. Good morning. You sleep okay? Yeah, like a log. Been ages since I've done that. All right then, shall we? The prickle boars lurk to the left of the entry gate. It's an ideal hunting place. Got it. All right, let's go. <sighs> She's still behind me. Yep.
Okay, I need to figure out how to open my map again. I don't remember how to do that. Ah, uh, crap. I'll have to do that. I'll have to figure that out. I'll... Oh, no. I'll do. Okay, bump this. Quick save real quick. Alright. So I'll see you guys in a minute. God dang it. Let me see if you have something to do with... Oh. Okay. Now I see what the problem was. And we're back, guys. Sorry about all that. Um... What are those creatures? What do you mean, creatures? They're goats. Goats? Are they usually this big? There's a prickle boar. So that's one, huh? Their meat is easy to preserve when smoked, and super tasty. And the skin has all kinds of uses, too. I almost feel sorry for it. Want to leave? No, my spirit is prepared. Besides, I can't get this sort of experience back home. Okay. Anybody else realize Saray is like... Anyone else realize that Saray is like a giant compared to this chick? God damn, I messed up again. There. Okay. Guess we need a few more. Dang it. I don't see any around. You'll find him if you look. Well, guess I know what I'm titling this video. Okay, so I've managed to fix some of the controls, so now I can actually move around Is that a without too much worry. Okay, that's just difficulty differences. I don't need that. Bingo. Right, how many more do I need? Eight of them? Focus, guys. No, no, you have not. Another one. I am ready. I keep. Uh, I'm sorry that I keep doing that. I keep pressing the uh, triangle button to the X button. Stepping. Like I said before, some of these I'm not gonna actually read until I go into editing. So for anybody going like, "Oh, Robin, why didn't you do this? This, this?" I'll more than likely read over it while I'm editing. What's that? Is it the goat? Yep. Such robust horns, just like the dragons of legend. <laughs> what, like in fairy tales? Or something else? Don't go near it! There's no telling how dangerous untamed beasts like those are. Ah, don't worry. We're friends. Uh, well, mostly. They did kick me four or five times when I was little. 
Your friends? Yep. Sometimes they give me milk, and I make cheese and yogurt with everyone. The mark of true friendship. Yeah, it's the best. <laughs> I think you I think she still thinks you're crazy. Okay, we need more of these, but I don't see any. I don't think we can leave the village, actually. We'll hit this thing out. I just saw a monolith written in ancient tongue. Targeting, not gonna read that. Mm. Yeah, it it looks like we can't leave the village. I finished preparing the gel. Gather eight pelts and then return home. Really wish I could run a little bit faster, because this is kinda slow for me. Yeah. You know what would be weird is just I start playing that um what song was it? That song that was like all over the That song that was all over the place for a while. That weird running man challenge thing. Just because of the leash because of this girl's running. And why am I down here again? I don't understand why I went back there. Okay, good. Let's head home for the day. Goodness, he runs slow. So very slowly. <sighs> Whatever. Da -da -da. Is it to Lady Lake? Let's see. I expect about two or three days. Really? I had no idea it was so close. But the forest at the base of the mountain is surprisingly easy to get lost in. Must be the power of Gramps' domain. Did I wake you? Sorry about that. You're sure into that book, aren't you? I've read it countless times since my childhood. One day, I want to explore ruins all over the world. Everyone who's read the Celestial Records says that, and I'm no exception. But sadly, now is not the time for some jaunt around the world. For several years now, the world has been plunged into a nigh-incomprehensible state of chaos. Chaos? Mysterious illnesses, incessant storms, people bursting into flames. There are those that say, even the dead have begun to walk the earth again. 
Whoa, hang on. What are you talking about? You don't believe me? Or you think this is a joke? No, I... The situation is beyond grave. Huh? The chaos has caused abnormal climate changes all over the world. As a result, we are on the verge of enduring widespread crop death, famine, and starvation. And worst of all, are the rumors of governments planning to replenish their dwindling resources through war. It mustn't come to that. Can nothing be done? Who knows? There's nothing to hang on to but legends. Which is why you... Never mind. I won't ask. I think I'm gonna just hit the hay here myself. Sleep well. Good morning. Good morning. You ready to get to work? We gotta make those rations and bags from the prickle boars we hunted yesterday. You got it. <laughs> Afraid it isn't exactly super fun, though. Well, let me know when you're ready to start. Well, I got nothing else to do, so... Sure. Ready? So, what do you need me to do? Get out of my face. Sorry for putting you to work like this. Oh, I'm pretty used to it. With your help, I'll be able to leave tomorrow. Thanks so much. Yeah? Great. Well, better rest up for tomorrow. I ought to let Gramps know. He doesn't sound too happy about that. Wish I'd asked her more about the world below. And I think I'll be right back.